Chuckers, and welcome to Quirky Crafts and Collectibles on Pandora Box. And on today's episode, we're going to have a look at the Mulan set, gift set. Impossible. A woman leading a man's army. It is my duty to fight for the kingdom. A girl who has come to save the dynasty. You will die pretending to be something you're not. Yet here I stand. I'm Hua Mulan. I will bring honor to us all. Disney's Mulan. And um, this is the actual figures of the actual movie. I'm not into the actual, you know, characters of the, the movies and stuff like that. Like, you know, the real Mulan. Uh, I'm more Disney cartoon orientated. And that's why I've got all the cartoony effects. So I want to show that Hasbro have done this uh, uh, gift set. The reason I bought this, it was on sale. $15. I had to grab it when it got to that point. $2. Um, I just couldn't let it go. And if they have articulation that I'm hoping they have, I think they're going to lose their bodies to somebody else. <laughs> well, lose their heads to somebody else. So let's have a look at Mulan. So if you want to read that, there you go. That's You can pause. I think that's all in, uh, just the top line, the, the top block that's in English. Okay, that's Milan illustration, and on the side, not much there, not much there, and I'm, I bought this a while ago, so I haven't had the chance to um, un, un, um, box this, so without further ado, let's do it. Okay, so, um, easiest way, the top, tape. Tape. I'm, I'm more interested to see what their bodies are like in their articulation than anything else. Like I said, for $15, I couldn't go past it. And if they've got some colour matches that will suit some of my dolls that I that I have that need matching my bodies. I should always open them from the bottom. Because they just slide right out, usually. Okay, so this is a better look at the dolls. There we go. Better look at the dolls without the glare. Now, as for her mask, that is moulded on. It's painted, so it's not going to come off. So she's stuck with that face. So she looks like a little, a, a younger version of her. Um, I haven't actually, have I watched this movie? I can't remember if I've watched it or not. Maybe I have, maybe I haven't. I just can't remember. It mustn't been that good if I have. Okay. Well, bear with me. I'll be right back and, um, I'll unbox both of these girls. <laughs> and I'm back. Well, there you are. Here are the girls, um, out of their, their boxes. First impression. Um, let's start with this one. I'll just put her there for now. Hang on. Um, okay, first impression. So, a lot of plastic. I can see the fabric down here is like that plastic. Oh, okay, saw something I don't like. Anyway. So, as I was looking at the back, looking at the skirt, I noticed her leg is green. So, they've given her, that's the boots, they've given her um, green, green legs. So, that means she's not a good candidate for a, another doll, unless she wears something else underneath to keep it 
That's her shawl, her shield, whatever. Um, her hair's nice. She's got these two kind of plaits on the front there. Um, she's got this thing on the head. Okay, let's have a look at this thing. Where has it come off? Oh, it clips off. That's her corset. And I'm going to take the dress off because it's all about the body in these dolls. Okay, it's like a very young type of body. Doesn't look like a warrior to me. She's got articulation in the wrist, shoulder. And they've put the stopper up the thing. I don't know why. And the shoulders. And of course the head goes up and down and around. The legs have articulation just on the knee. But it's green. So that just throws everything out the window for her. So I'll just probably pop her back into that outfit. Let's have a look at this one. Now, I don't know which one's Milan. I don't know if they're both Milan or this one's Milan. Her, her hair is softer. So she comes with a sword. First thing I'm going to look at, she's got pants. Okay, so she's got this thing on. So it's rubber, so it comes off. Does the sword go in? I don't know if it the sword goes in. There's a hole there. Um, that comes off. Plastic and this thing comes off as well. So, yes, so far, so good. The boots, <gasps> she doesn't have any colored. Besides skin color. She's a winner. Let's have a look at the body first before we look at anything else. So she's a good a good body. A really good body. Very basic. Very similar to um, um, extra Barbie, but she's she's got a young, small, petite body. So she'd be good for like a teenage uh, doll. She's got a, a, a grab hand, wrist, and the other one is like pointy. You are the master. Um, let's put her top back on. Her dress. So that's her dress. The Velcro's at the back. So that's pretty good, I think. Got a winner there. <laughs> So I can find out. She well, she's got a, she's got a, a nice face. I'll say she's got a nice face. So um, you know she could be somebody's daughter. She could be the other Milan's younger daughter. Although they're more cartoony faces, she's got more of a realistic face. So maybe one of the Bar Barbie extra dolls. I'll put her pants back on. it back on so she can have that look and that's quite nice I like that look or she can have all that armor on her the hair's nice it's not too bad it's soft very straight we've just got somebody driving in the driveway <laughs> and then she's got her boots as well So I don't mind this one. This one, she's, she's bigger, or well, she's the same. She's the, actually the same body. I thought she was actually bigger, but she's actually the same. They've got both, yeah, they've got the same feet. So standing back to back, they are the same doll. She just looked bigger. Maybe she was displayed different 
in the actual box to make her look bigger. But they are the same size doll. So she sits quite well. But unfortunately, this one here, because of her, um, her face mask and the green legs, it just, just doesn't work. So I'll probably end up keeping her in this outfit. That's a nice outfit she could probably wear as well. So I don't know what this was for. This was another outfit that she wore in the uh, in the movie. I just can't remember. But it's this is a nice this is a nice um, outfit. It's a shame they couldn't put pants or tights on her. They did with that one. So they cheated. So Hasbro do quite well, and then they they kind of like cheat elsewhere. Oh, you know, we'll, we'll design these. This, this dress for her and make it look fantastic. Oh, could be bothered putting colored legs on her, so, or skin color tone. So we're just making green. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That way we don't have to worry about extra. I mean, the, the boots are great. I mean, I didn't notice, but it, because, yeah, anyway, that's, 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 that's it there. So she'll just be a, a, a style of doll that will just be on the shelf looking glamorous, I suppose. I can't use her for anything else. Where this one I can. So, win-win. It's not too bad, win-win. Petite, very petite. So she might be able to fit into a petite outfit. Uh, she could stand with the girls as well, with the extra <laughs> I love, they both have the same, Point on their finger. What are they pointing at? Ah, you are the child. <laughs> so they're quite nice. I mean, look, for fifteen dollars, I can't, I can't complain. If I had spent the um, the amount that they first come out, I would have been really, really disappointed. Like really disappointed. Um, spending that much money and. You know, and got what I got. I just, yeah, but like for fifteen bucks, I'm not going to complain. Like I said, um, I thought I might be able to use both of these uh, bodies for donors for other dolls. Still might, depends. Um, depends what I've got. All this armor and that. Um, might use it for a fancy dress. <laughs> party one day they've both got great great boots so that's great this the, I mean look the plastic armor and everything's quite nice I don't mind it but um, how I'd use it yeah so she'll just keep these in well there you go um, if you've got these dolls what did you think were you happy with them were they up to your standard of what dolls are or do they um, disappoint you when you open them and thought oh okay um, if you paid the full amount and you got what you got, were they worthy? <laughs> um, I don't know what to say. <laughs> anyway, yeah. Well, there you are. Let me know what you think. Comment down below. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't already subscribed and hit that bell button so you don't miss any of my future episodes. And um, yeah. Give me a like if you like the show. <laughs> well, I'm Pandora Box. Until next time, chuckers!